Hey, Rooney. Hi. Hi, hi, hi. So, how are you? I'm good, and you? Thanks for asking. I'm doing good. So, uh, can we start our case study now? Yeah, sure. We can start. Okay. Can you tell me a little bit more about yourself and as well as your company? Uh, any other interesting information about you, so mm. that the audience will know more about you? Okay. So, uh, uh, my name is Ronnie. Uh, my my business is called Elixir Design. It's okay. a brand identity and website uh, design company. So we create different brand identities of companies and also the websites together. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, that's that's what we do. So is there anything special you want to tell our audience? Like, oh, I have achieved this or I have done this so grateful. Is there anything specific in mention? Um, uh, in terms of the business? Yes, in terms of business. Um... Right now, I can't say anything in particular. Mm -hmm. um, could you make it a bit more specific, maybe, the question? Bit, yes, a bit more specific, as in, like, I've been working in this industry for quite long. So, like, so like that, I like. Ah, aha, aha. Okay, so so I've, I've been working in the industry for around seven years. Um, if it's in, in terms of how many websites we've done so far, I think uh, it's... it's it, it's crossed the 70 marks. So it's above 70 websites. So it's been oh, okay. quite good. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. So can you tell me about your business structure, your company size, and how long you've been in this industry? So in terms of how long I've been in the industry, right? Uh, this year, it hit uh, seven years. Mm -hmm. So with how I work, my structure is like, okay, so I'm, because I founded the company, Mm -hmm. um, when I get work, sometimes mm -hmm. I get, uh, I have other contractors who help me to do different mm -hmm. things. Mm -hmm. So right now it's like a one, 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 one month company, mm -hmm. but I have contractors from outside who help with various specializations. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's great. Yeah. yeah. So, so what are the challenges you faced initially, which mm -hmm. made you to use goals and forms? Uh -huh. So the challenge I had was um, on my website. I had I had a chat uh, a chat uh, what was that the chat pop up. So mm -hmm. I didn't want to have to keep on answering the questions there because mm -hmm. there are, there, are, there are set a uh, number of questions I used to ask clients to like mm -hmm. weigh them and know if we are the best fit. So I used Gozen form to now make that work easier for me. So okay. I set all the questions and then I loved the logic feature. So oh. if they answer this, if, if they give a certain answer, it takes them to a different set of questions yes, yes. like that. So that, that made my work so much easier. Yeah, okay. That's 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 that. okay. So before trying Gozen forms, what mm -hmm. are the other solutions did you try before and why did they didn't work for you? Okay, so I tried like three other solutions. The first one was uh, Google Forms. Mm -hmm. Google Forms was good. Yes, it worked, but I wasn't able to make advanced forms. So okay. like using the, log the logic feature, mm -hmm. I couldn't really customize the design as mm -hmm. much as I wanted. Okay. And I couldn't em embed it per se on the website in the way I wanted to. Uh, another one, I, I use another one called Hello Bonsai, the, the forms, but the forms are too basic. So okay. the reason I came and started using Gozen is because um, they had, it has more advanced features and I was able to also now integrate it with uh, the system I use ClickUp okay. so that I can just get uh, results inside there. Yeah. Thank you. So where did you find Gozen forms? Um, so I was, I was looking for a form build and then on google i found it on appsumo actually oh, yeah. so you found yeah google so i yes yes i found it on appsumo and then i just looked through it and decided to give it a shot yeah oh okay that's yes, great so, so what made you uh to try out goes and forms from other different products out there in the market so what what made me choose goes and forms was first of all it was cost effective um I, I I got a really good deal. Um and that made me now stick to it uh, instead of the other 
ones I got, and also it had more features, and it also improving. Uh, I've seen I'm seeing an improvement in it um, since the time I purchased it. So, and I also get really good support. Yeah. Okay, that's yeah. great. So, in Bosun forms, what are the specific features you use the most? The features I use the most uh, right now, what I can say is log the logic okay. section. That's logic. that's been most helpful. That's what I use the most. Okay, you yeah. play a lot with the logic parts. Okay. Yes. Yes. Yeah. What are the end results do you get in the Bosun forms in the terms of responses as well as revenue? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so in terms of responses, I got a 30% increase in uh, my conversion rates with the, oh. with the forms. Okay. Yeah, because it was easier for people to fill in and um, I could now, while using the logic feature, I could get them to get them uh, customized questions for each person. Yeah. Okay. And then in terms of revenue, the, the, the increase in revenue was around $2,000 just because of that, that form. Oh. So that, that was the increase, yeah. Okay, that's great. So what was your overall experience in using goes and forms? Overall, my experience has been, it, it has been really good because like, first of all, the, the interface was simple to use. Um, I didn't have to read through any document documentation i just had to click and uh just fill in what whatever i wanted to do and then i also got the new ai feature that made it okay so so much more easier to create my my forms yeah okay my next question is uh would you recommend those in forms to other businesses yes yes 100 percent. i would uh, okay. recommend it to other businesses yeah that's okay. a no-brainer yeah okay fine so my last question is, how much do you rate out of five for goes and forms? Out of five? Yes. Uh, if out of five, I'd give it a five. That's a solid oh. five. Okay. Yeah. Thank, yeah. You. Thank, you. Thank you so much for the case study and all the best for your business as well. Bye-bye. Thank you so much. Bye. Thank you so much.